developing tonight in Seminole County. A 50-year-old Winter Springs man is struggling to stay alive in the hospital tonight. Investigators say two Sanford teenagers beat him with a hammer. Eyewitnesses saw the attack last Monday at Beardall Avenue and Lincoln Street. And while detectives say they have evidence to arrest the teens, they told Channel 9's Bianca Castro they don't know what triggered the attack. Two guys beat the guy with a hammer, beat the white guy in the bushes there with a hammer. A 911 caller details the brutal beating that happened inside these woods near the Sanford Airport last Monday. Investigators say 18-year-old Julius Bender and 19-year-old Jehaziel Israel beat a 50-year-old white male with a hammer inside his SUV. Then they dragged him to the woods and beat him some more, all in the middle of the afternoon. The guy don't stop hollering. I can't see him. Maybe they knocked him out or killed him. I don't know. When deputies found him, he was barely conscious. They say after for the beating, the duo took off in his SUV. Investigators found the victim's SUV abandoned in this lot about half a mile away. It's similar to our vehicle here, except black. And inside, they found traces of blood. Investigators have not been able to question the victim yet because of the severity of his injuries. They've asked us not to identify him, but we learned the man is from Winter Springs and does not have a criminal history. Right now, investigators aren't sure why he was targeted. It's scary because I have kids. Regina Gardner lives right down the road that she says is normally quiet. The crime has put her and her neighbors on edge. I just hope that he do make it through and he could, it, we could actually shed some light on what really happened. In Seminole County, Bianca Castro, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. The victim is in critical condition at Orlando Regional Medical Center. Both teens face burglary and attempted murder charges.